My name is Paul McCaig. I am a reader at the School of Pharmacy. One of my roles within the school is Director for Student Engagement and Support for Pharmacy Students. My name is Siobhan McCartan and I am the Timetable and Coordinator for the University. And in my role I manage the timetable and process, the training for it. I enrolled in the Connected Leaders program in October 2019. I undertook the course to acquire new skills but also to enhance my existing ones. I had hoped to gain insight into what other leaders do in the university. Am I doing the right thing or you know what perspective I would get from others as well. I really enjoyed the delivery of the course. My Connected Leaders program started in 2019 and at that stage it was face-to-face -face workshops up in Riddle Hall. Then with the pandemic we transitioned to online in March 2020. One of the great benefits of having those initial face-to-face -face sessions that we were able to build up the connections and build up a relationship with the groups of people that we were working with. It was very collaborative, it was relaxed, it was different, it was varied, it was very involved. I enjoyed the vast range of teaching activities that we undertook. So there was facilitated discussions, there was peer coaching, there was group work and there was guest speakers sharing their experiences of their own leadership journey. It was hugely beneficial to work with a range of colleagues from across the university. I found the peer coaching sessions particularly useful and helpful. Within our groups we could share our knowledge and our experience. It was good to get not opinions but other options to explore in your daily work as well and any, you know, coming up with solutions together as well rather than just looking at the problem I'm going, this is how you fix it. It was useful to get impartial feedback from somebody that was removed from our own direct area. So for example, we were in groups with people from other directorates or other schools or departments, and they were able to give us impartial advice and feedback on how they would approach a particular challenge. I undertook the additional work uh, in order to gain the ILM Level 3 Award in Leadership and Management. I have to say the programme delivery team were extremely helpful and supportive. Those of us who were undertaking the additional work. So that involved undertaking two additional assignments. The programme team put on additional tutorials and Q&A sessions to help support us through that process. So it was a nice bonus at the end of the Connected Leaders course to have that additional accredited qualification. It was good to see how others, the way they come out uh, from the psychometric testing as well, that we're all varied, we all look at things differently. Just getting that perspective from others, you know, sometimes you think, well this is the role I do, this is the way I've done it for 10 years, but maybe asking someone else, you know, what do you think? Do you think there's a better way of doing this? And working collaboratively with them and getting their opinion and looking at it from a different angle. The key takeaways that I have from the course is the importance of effective communication in order to build relations within the team and ultimately to achieve goals. I would say absolutely go for it. Working with people from other areas of the university that you wouldn't maybe meet, seeing the challenges that they would have, working with them through challenges and them helping you through yours. And we're all you know, one university, we're all one team. And if you know work that working together will bring success. I would highly recommend the Connected Leaders course to anybody who's seeking to enhance their leadership skills as part of their professional development. I'm very grateful for the invaluable lessons that I've learned in the course and the people that I've met and the networks that I've built through undertaking the program.